Hi guys and welcome. I'm Philip English from RoboField.com and on this video we're looking into the top 24 extraordinary ectoskeletons. Hi guys, I'm Philip English and welcome to the top 24 extraordinary exoskeletons. This is where I do a rundown of the latest Iron Man devices. And don't forget guys, if you're looking to get your hands on any of my videos, then please visit robofill.com where you can find out where to get them. A powered exoskeleton, also known as powered armour, exoframe, hard suit or exosuit, is a wearable mobile machine that is powered by a system of motors, pneumatics, levers or hydraulics that allow for limb movement, increased strength and endurance. Starting with the EXO GT, EXO Bionics is the leading developer of exoskeleton solutions that amplify human potential by supporting or enhancing strength, endurance and mobility across medical, industrial and defence applications. Hybrid Assistive Limb How? Cyberdyne commercialises the inventions of Professor Sankey and his laboratories at the University of Tsukuba. The company's flagship product is the hybrid assist limb How suit, which enables or augments human motor functions by reading nerve signals through the skin. Body Extender The body extender has been built by the Perceptual Robotics Laboratory at the Pisa Scholar Superior St. Anne's. The machine can enable users to lift up to 50 kilograms in each extender hand and is being developed to work in factories or to clear debris and rescue survivors in earthquake zones. Assistant Suit AWN03. The Assistant Suit AWN03 costs about $8,000, that's £5,000, and offers a maximum of 50 kilograms force. Designed to be worn by human adults weighing between 50 and 80 kilograms. The device weighs about 6 kilograms, although this does not include the weight of the battery and the harness. This exoskeleton has been developed by Active Link, the robot development arm of Panasonic. Fortis Ectoskeleton Lockheed Martin, a leader in exoskeleton technology, developed Fortis as a human-powered system to reduce metabolic burn rate by literally taking the weight of shipbuilders' tools off their shoulders and transferring it to the ground. The exoskeleton is able to support tools of up to 16 kilograms. Chairless Chair The Chairless Chair exoskeleton developed by Swiss startup Nuni is essentially a clever application of mechanics. The device attaches to your hips and shoes and straps to both your thighs and calves. When active, a damper takes the load from your thighs and funnels it into the heels of your shoes. Dr. Miguel Nicolas Mind Control Exoskeleton. A paraplegic man made the first kickoff at the Brazilian World Cup 2014 by using a mind controlled robot exoskeleton. His robotic exoskeleton was created by a team of more than 150 researchers led by Brazilian neuroscientist Dr. Miguel Nicolas. Exoskeleton Boots. A team of engineers from Carnegie Mellon University led by Stephen Collins has developed a mechanical exoskeleton boot that reduces the energy needed to walk by 7% compared to normal footwear. Gobio Robot Exoskeleton. Gobio offers a partnership with a range of exhaust exoskeletons to reduce muscular skeletal disorders, MSD, in your company. 
Gobio Robot helps provide a response to professionals seeking to improve the working conditions of their employees, as well as helping vulnerable people or dependents to maintain an independent life as long as possible. Hercule. RB3D, a company specialised in strength assistance, has involved the codes of building exoskeletons with a new Hercule version. Hercule version 3 is powerful and has compact legs and a front platform that can be adapted for a wide range of uses. Raytheon XOS2 Exoskeleton. The wearable robotic suit increases the human strength, agility and endurance capabilities of the soldier inside it. The XOS2 uses high pressure hydraulics to allow the wearer to lift heavy objects at a ratio of 17 to 1, actual weight to perceived weight. This allows repeated lifting of the load without exhaustion or injury. Deu Exoskeleton. The exoskeleton fits anyone between 160 and 185 centimeters tall. Workers do not feel the weight of the 28 kilogram frame of carbon aluminum alloy and steel as the suit supports itself and is engineered to follow the wearer's movements. With a three hour battery life, the exoskeleton allows users to walk at a normal pace and in its prototype form, it can lift objects with a mass of up to 30 kilograms. Rewalk. Rewalk is a wearable robotic exoskeleton that provides powered hip and knee motion to enable individuals with spinal cord injury, SCI, to stand upright, walk, turn and climb and ascend stairs. Rewalk offers two systems, Rewalk Personal 6.0 and Rewalk Rehabilitation. Harmony. Researchers at the Cockrell School of Engineering at the University of Texas in Austin have now developed Harmony, a two-armed robotic exoskeleton that uses mechanical feedback and sensor data to provide therapy to patients with spinal and neurological injuries. AFA Exoskeleton. The AFA, which stands for Advanced Fighting Apparatus Exoskeleton, is the master degree design project of Ken Chen, a graduate student at the Monash University in Melbourne. While there is no working prototype of as yet, the AFA concept is based on existing military and industrial exoskeleton systems. Soft exosuits. Harvard Biodesign Lab are developing next generation soft wearable robots that use innovative textiles to provide a more comfortable, unobtrusive and complement means to interface to the human body. These robots will argument the capabilities of healthy individuals in addition to assisting those with muscle weakness or patients who suffer from physical or neurological disorders. Max Fass Exoskeleton. Dan Beechler, a mechanical engineer at the US Army Research Laboratory, that's ARL, is developing the Max Fass Exoskeleton that doesn't make soldiers stronger, but better shots instead. The trick is to train the shooter's hands so it remains steady during the critical moments. This is the purpose of Max Fass. Walk-in Assist Honda Motor Company robotic device is used for walk-in rehabilitation under the guidance of doctors and or therapists. It's based on the inverted pendulum module, a theory of bipedal walking, and features two motors that help lift the leg at the thigh as it moves forwards and backwards. This lengthens the user's stride and helps them walk further and faster.
Robomate. Robomate project began in 2013 as a consortium of 12 research institutes and companies in seven European countries. The idea is to produce a powered exoskeleton that acts as a support frame that can reduce the physical workload for assembly and disassembly work by a factor of 10. So an exoskeleton designed specifically for industrial use that can make 10 kilos feel like one kilo. REX. REX is an exoskeleton made of strong, lightweight materials that is designed to support and hold a person comfortably as they move. Users strap themselves into the robotic legs with a number of Velcro and buckle straps and fit around the legs along with a belt that fits around the user's waist. Phoenix. Phoenix is built by 2X and is the world's most affordable powered exoskeleton. With the help of crutches, it allows disabled users to walk by moving and bending their legs for them. It builds on technology developed by a team from the University of California at Berkeley's Human Engineering Lab. Mitsubishi Exoskeletons. Mitsubishi Heavy Industrial and Japan Atomic Power Company have developed a prototype powered exoskeleton for nuclear disasters. Mitsubishi labels this wearable robot as a powered assistance suit or PASS. This is the first entry of both Mitsubishi Heavy Industrial and the Japan Atomic Power Company in the exoskeleton field. Hyundai Exoskeleton Korean auto giant Hyundai has revealed images of a beefy, tougher looking robotic exoskeleton aimed at the transportation, industrial and military markets. The suit which is still in its pre-production form would let you lift and manipulate objects weighing up to 60 kilograms, that's 132 pounds, with no stress to your legs, arms or back. NASA X-1 The X-1 is a robot that a human can wear over his or her body either to assist or inhibit movement in the leg joints. The device was developed with a dual purpose. One, to assist astronauts in walking on extraterrestrial surfaces and maintain leg strength while in microgravity. And two, to assist paraplegics in walking on Earth. Thanks guys, I hope you enjoyed the 24 extraordinary exoskeletons. I'm your host, Philip English. Please visit robofield.com if you want to find out where to procure any of the robots in my videos and to find out lots of other robots you can add to your collection. Now if you like this robot video and want to see even more of the latest robotic news, reviews and robotic tutorials, then please hit the subscribe button to be up to date with the latest videos that come out. Please have a look below as well where I've put links relating to these videos as well as other information and web links for your review. If you have any questions or want to see any other robot tutorials or review videos, then please write me a message in the comments section and I'll see what I can do. Thanks guys, looking forward to see you next time.